What did you think of uh, Green Bay's first performance? Um, you know, just you know, clearly didn't didn't execute on their part or what what whatever they were feeling. But um, we're not necessarily worried about how what how they do. We're worried about how uh, how we do. And um, this game's about us and not them. What's the significance of being the honorary captain? I mean, it's pretty huge. Um, anytime you can be a captain and. Uh, be up there representing the team and, and this great organization uh, means a lot. It's it's pretty impactful for me. I mean, you know, I know it's going to be a storyline, me going back there and all that, but um, it's pretty cool to be an honorary captain for this game and um, be out there on uh, Lambeau with my guys. Does that mean more, the storyline and going back to Lambeau and being the captain this week? No, I mean, it's, you know, I want to win every game. Um, you know, that's just the mentality I, I have and expect to win every game. Um, be like, yes, it'll be cool. I'll probably have a little different routine when the coin toss happens and, you know, me just uh, putting my ball cap on and, and doing the, uh, you know, national anthem. But, um, yeah, just got to go out there and win the game. How's the hand with um, everything? It's doing well. Yeah, I feel like it's progressing. Are you feel like you're getting closer? Uh, you know, that's a question for the medical staff probably. Look, Lucas, did you have to play a different way or use different technique or anything to kind of make that work on Sunday? You know, like I said, I've done that before in my career. Um, have that uh, kind of bank reps way early on. Um, made the team uh, on the practice squad at Green Bay in 2016 with the club. So very, very used to this process. Uh, not, not too new. Have you ever done it before where you've been rotating in and out? And what, what are the challenges that go with that, just coming in and out? Uh, yeah, I mean, my first few years in the league, I was a rotational inside guy, so uh, I understand intricately how to prepare myself uh, to go in at a moment's notice or come out at a moment's notice. I mean, I've gone in for guys when shoelaces pop and have four plays and come out, and I've gone in with guys, unfortunately, don't return and finish games. Uh, so, you know, another another scenario I have a lot of bank reps in. Lucas, when you, when you were with the Packers, did you feel the frustration that opponents like the Bears felt trying to get the best of them? Uh, I, I don't understand your question. Did you notice that, that Rodgers frustrated you know, opponents and that team, teams were frustrated trying to beat them? The Bears have had a bad record against them. Did you guys, as, as, as players, did you feel that? The Bears were... Uh, when, I mean, just trying to win every game I'm a part of. Do you anticipate feeling strange? Um, speaking honestly, probably a lot of gratitude. Um, you know, I'm not going to sit here and, and bash an organization because uh, I wouldn't be here today standing with you all if it weren't for uh, the opportunity afforded to me. Um, had a lot of memories there with, you know, close family and friends and still have, you know, I know you guys probably don't like to hear this, but we have personalities and feelings. So <laughs> I've got some friends still there. Um, so yeah, I'll, I'll definitely have some gratitude and some emotions, but at the end of the day, I have a job to do and gonna execute that job. You know very well how Aaron Rodgers feels and responds after a loss. What do you expect from him and that Green Bay team this weekend, coming off of their defense? Yeah, I, I hope to get their best shot. I hope they come prepared, um, you know, because we're gonna prepare as hard as we can and, and have things ready to go. What's he, what's, he, what's he like coming off a loss? Like, how does he dial in? That's a question for him. What are you most thankful about looking back at your time there? Like you said, you have relationships and family and friends. Yeah. As a player, what do you know? Where do you think you um, pro Probably the, uh, you know, it's a little bit smaller town than Chicago. Um, it's a joke, you know. Um, but uh, just the relationships with not only the players but the staff. Um, you know, if you're any place for six years and I had some um, – formative life experiences while there and so it's hard not to have those relationships and those experiences so just yeah just gratitude um, and thankful to be here and standing here today and you know being a Chicago Bear.